So I am on a spur trail, just left Mazama Valley, village, whatever you want to call it. Camped there last night, so didn't quite make it to Crater Lake, but got that awesome resupply package from Tim, which was really fun, and camped with a bunch of old friends, including Sirloin, and I hadn't seen in a minute, which was really healthy mentally, I think, because he also knew Finn really well aka colors <laughs> and uh yeah it's just good to you know see other people who can relate that knew how amazing he was but anyway um gonna reach Crater Lake today get some awesome views camp somewhere near it get some sunset sun sunrise tomorrow uh there's some sections of trail close through here one they're clearing trees for fired hazards and stuff like that and then uh, another section, there's a mama cougar with two cubs that has been practicing their hunting skills on uh, stalking hikers. <laughs> so they closed off a section due to that. But I think that's more of a side trail to a campground anyway for us. So I don't think that section is going to affect me too much. But yeah, almost back to the PCT here from this little spur trail from the campground and then we'll be back in business we'll see how today goes I haven't been able to upload anything in quite a while because I haven't had any service hardly in the past I don't know maybe six days so yeah all right made it back to the trail Heading towards Crater Lake now. Super stoked. I've been waiting for this. This is one of those points on this trail that I've really been looking forward to. Even though I didn't grow up very far from here, I've never been here and always heard about it. <laughs> it's like McAfee knob on the AT to a lot of people. This is this is a big one for me today, so I'm excited to see it. <laughs> take lots of pictures so I can paint it have my breath taken away you know all of the things <clears throat> and whoo is my pack heavy right now I feel like a slug all right there's a lot of people here <laughs> obviously it's a busy spot super excited for this I've been wanting to see this pretty much my whole life I don't know which way to go first even oh man I can see it this is exciting. Oh boy, gonna hike along this, all on that left side there and around. Should be fan freaking tastic. Ooh, I can't wait. Look at this. Holy crap. That water is so blue. Maybe there's trolleys and stuff. Holy crap, that's blue. This is amazing. Oh my gosh, it looks fake. It looks like velvet, blue velvet. Wow, this is amazing. And there's someone out there on a boat. That would be so fun. It fell. It filled. Alright, there you go. That's how it worked. I've never seen water this blue before. It's kind of neat. I was noticing that there's still some snow at the base over there. Water's got to be super cold. 
Oh, I can't wait for the sunset tonight. So this is the ninth deepest lake, I think, in the world. Can you imagine this as a giant mountain just blowing its top? Whew, it's like 2,000 feet deep. It's incredible. Wonder what lives at the bottom. I wonder if they make blue paint that's even blue enough that I can paint with it. <laughs> well, it makes the sky look, you know, white almost. It's crazy. So amazing. We're going to have a million photos we decided of this thing. It's just so freaking big. It's blowing my mind. And blue. The blue. I can't get over the blue. That's a cool shot. Taking a little break so I can readjust my pack. The weight's getting to me and rubbing me raw. But this is pretty. We thought it was gonna be a cruisy flat trail around this thing. It's definitely not, <laughs> but it's worth it. Okay, so I'm wondering now is, how do we get to hike this? I can see a little bit of a trail right there. I want to go over there. Does anybody know if we're allowed to or if there's a permit for that? If you look closely, you can see the little dip in the top. I want to go over there. Someone tell me. Or you got these people down here in this pontoon boat. Or whatever that is. Just cruising. Look at the colors in the water down there. Whew, there's a little cool little lake right there even. Pretty awesome. On the other side of this little thing here you can see there's some like probably ranger stations or something. A couple docks. Yeah, I don't know. And you still got some snow. Tired of that stuff for a while. Pass. Ivy won't let me walk out on here. Not gonna happen. <laughs> it does look like it might fall apart, so I think he wins. But I was a little tempted. Starting a new thing, beard dreadlocks. I almost dried in my beard, or at least I was gonna do biking braids to cut my hair. I figured I'd never be able to keep them in. So, how do you think I'm doing? Huh? <laughs> oh my god! <laughs> it's kind of janky, huh? But it could be a thing. Hot. I'm I be tight. <laughs> Wait, you don't talk like that. Sup, <laughs> motherfuckers? <laughs> Let's drink some coffee. <laughs> What a dork. <laughs> I'm trying, but it, you know. How do you maintain these things? Good. God.
No one will ever know it's me. Hey, I could go into town and pretend I'm you. Maybe I'll get lots more free food. Get kicked out of Walmarts. Oh, I'm a rebel. I think mine's longer than yours. Oh, for sure. <laughs> Looks good. Thanks. <laughs> I think this is the best spot. Is it? I mean, this is a pretty amazing spot. I'm trying to figure out where to stealth camp <laughs> since the well, normal. This is at least blocked. Yeah, these trees, the like, trail's behind us, but people won't see us here. Yeah, it'll be perfect. The other ones are more exposed to the trail, so. Yeah, Even there's. Those fuckers up in the moon tower up there won't see us back in here, I think. It'll be perfect. The normal trail is closed due to cougar activity, so. Aliens. And, and the aliens. <laughs> So we're forced to find other places to to camp, to make home. But this isn't a bad spot. Woo! That looks so different already. Be a long way down. We just gotta make sure nothing rolls off the side of the hill here. I roll around a lot in my sleep. I'm kind of worried. <laughs> Almost lost his food bag earlier. <laughs> huh? I said you almost lost your food bag earlier. Yeah. Yeah. We would have went after that though. No problem. The craziest beam of light I'm getting. <laughs> Look at that. It's insane. So we'd be cowboy camping right here. That will be bed for the night. This will be backyard. Look at the pink picking up on the water over there. Ooh, it's gonna be so beautiful. Not a bad place to call home. The colors are changing. You're definitely right. That color looks amazing. Oh, so cool. I bet it's going to get even richer here in just a little bit. So beautiful, look at that. Oh, it's breathtaking. It's surreal, and I'm standing right beside it. And then I'm gonna sleep right beside it. <laughs> oh, I am so lucky. Look at all those colors in the sky. Oh man. That's just beautiful. That's where we're camping. <laughs> so here we are at Crater Lake. Sunset. Gonna be cowboy camping right there on top of that beautiful cliff. Oh, drink my coffee there in the morning. Watching the sunset hit. Look at those colors. This beautiful island. It looks fake. 